the point in the second set where you know you bring another set or I don't know if you're trying to save some people's legs because being a mathematician you probably realized the metrics will say it's gonna go five maybe four but definitely five when you don't hold two you guys didn't panic well you know I think it came down to our leadership uh, we talked a little bit about where we needed to get to that part about end game end games our game and uh, we did you know after set two the leadership of that group definitely came together. Our you captains came together. I, they, saw, I saw you kind of step away and you let them... And you know, I think that's part of where these guys are coming full circle to understand that we're at the part of the season where they just have to do. All the things that we're doing tactically comes down to what they wanted with heart. Iolani played ex exceptionally. And for us to come back after being down 0-2 with the reverse sweep, especially in the end of that game, you know, we had a chance to swing. Devin took a good swing, that ball was out. We found a way to fight back and came back to win, which I'm very, very proud of our girls, but especially for the execution that we had. Tara played lights out. Kayla was awesome. It was a great team win for us across the board, and I'm super proud of what they did. I thought your sophomores are so talented, but then there's a moment every now and then, you, oh, okay, they're young. Yeah. They're going to make a, you know, a boo boo once in a while, but then they came back strong. Definitely, and I think Bree did an excellent job of running our offense. You know, again, I can't stress for how much of a team win that was for us. The Everybody's back, the back row, like the girls in the back row, who are the main girls in the back row? Well, Tara did exceptionally. Maui and Kay did good in the back. Mia came in the back for one of our players to do some work. And I think it came down to making the right execution in the right part of the game. And we train all year for it in the weight room, on the track, on the court. And it's, we're lucky to come out with a win. Hats off to Iolani, Coach Kainoa, what they brought. Uh, we were just able to execute right there at the end and proud of our proud of our team. I think Elena, I got up for 41 kills and there were a whole bunch of digs where people just threw up their arms just hoping to get a piece. Yeah. And you guys got a piece every time you needed it. Well, you know, she's one of the best players in the state and for her to do what she was doing and for us to come back and play that hard, you know, she puts a lot of pressure on us on D. But, you know, for her, her, her play, all that she's doing, hats off to her. She put us into a bad spot and made us get better to play. But I'm really proud of our team, how they rose up when it, when it mattered the most and uh, came out with that win. Was there anything, I mean, I think um, Brianne, man, she mentioned that at a certain point, I guess in the third set, you guys wanted to funnel more of the swings toward the Liberal area. Yeah, we did. And, it you was know, a little more general before that. Well, you know, she was, she was doing a lot of stuff. She sees the court so well. Yeah. She plays so well. It's a matter of us changing up things to make it a little bit harder for her. Um, I'm not sure if we did it, but we were able to execute right there at the end part of the match. We came out with the win. So you had a streak. Jerry, Jerry at my, my office looked up the numbers. You had a streak that went back almost 20 years of making the state tournament, making the state final. I don't think you worry about stuff like that, but it is a legacy. And you guys, much like I mentioned Rick Toon earlier, like, when the odds look very long, you guys find a way, you find a way. Well, I, I think the first thing I want to say is thanks to the band, thanks to the football team, thanks for the crowd. I think it made a big difference. You know, when we walked into their gym uh, last week, Tuesday, uh, it was a tough, tough uh, environment to play in. And I think, you know, th this made a difference. This is why we picked this side in game five. But back to what you're talking about, we believe that we play for those who have come before us, for those who are with us now, and those who are going to come after us. It was so good to see a lot of our former players are coming over here. Braylon was here. Tiana Hallams was here. You know, seeing all of them understand that they're a part of this legacy, and I think it's important for our girls. We talk about rising up like a wave and riding it. And I think, you know, when it came down to it, the end part of the match, uh, when things got tough, they stayed calm. When everything rose up, they rose up with it and rolled it uh, to a, to a five-set victory. How do you feel? Pretty good. <laughs> <laughs> we gotta get back in the gym. To, uh, back in the gym tomorrow. We got nature down. Thank you, Coach. Thank you very much.